Governor Chukuma Soludo has imposed 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. curfew for commercial motorcycles riders, shuttle buses, and tricycle riders in eight local government areas of Anambra State, starting from Monday 30th, May 2022. Governor Soludo, who was speaking in a live broadcast from the Governor's Lodge, Amobia, said that security is fundamental in the effort of his administration to enthrone a livable and prosperous homeland. Government House Correspondent Ijiki Abana has details. The bounty will depend upon the profile of the criminal. Their leaders will attract higher amounts. The local government areas include Aguata, Ihiela, Ekusigo, Newi North and South, Obaru, as well as Urumba North and South. Governor Soludo, who stressed that the directive will be reviewed in a fortnight, ordered security officials to begin immediate enforcement of the directive. The governor announced that in addition to the 10 million naira reward for information about killers of Honorable Loketuku Okoye and his aid, 1 million naira will be given to anyone who provides information leading to the arrest of anyone or group linked in any of these atrocious tendencies as well as information about anyone or location where hard drugs are manufactured in the state. According to the governor who asked union leaders to report their members who are involved in criminal activities, the measures are meant to address the spate of insecurity in the region. The hour has now come and we must rise up to take back, to take our destiny in our hands. Everyone, indeed everyone, has a role to play. While we continue to commit our number unto the hands of God, we as a people must rise up to clean and cleanse our land. The security agencies will continue to do their part, but we, the people, must proclaim that enough is enough. The governor pointed out that the state government will revoke and acquire any land found to be used and occupied by criminals. He also charged all landlords to begin Operation Know Your Tenants calling on market leaders to join hands with the government through weekly security reports to the state government. But Professor Soludo maintained that re-registration of vehicles used for transportation as a way of checking fake transporters. He charged all fuel stations to place cameras in their stations to trace criminals, expressing optimism that the season shall pass as such tough beginnings to usually foretells a glorious future and joining religious leaders to, to continue to pray for the state to succeed. All landlords are hereby directed to proceed on operation Know Your Tenant by keeping appropriate records of their tenants and report anyone suspected of being involved in criminal activities. Each community leadership must keep full register of all tenants in their communities, their occupation, etc., and keep an eye on the activities. The state government shall, as an emergency measure, disband the leadership of any community which fails to report criminal activities in their communities or immediately respond to the request contained in this address. The governor was flanked by service chiefs in the state. From the governor's lodge, Amorbia, Ejike Abana, ABS News.